Hi friends, welcome to Offer Studies YouTube channel. This is part 9 in Kusto playlist. In this video, we are going to discuss about project operator in Kusto query language. So, what is this project operator? We are going to see with an example. If you know SQL, this project operator is equals to select actually. In SQL, you use select statement to get the uh, rows from a table with defined columns, right? If you have columns A to Z, maybe you want to get only M, N, O columns, then select M, N, O, something like that, right? So, similar to select in Kusto, if you want to get any columns which you should be included in the output, or if you can even the rename the columns or drop the columns or insert new computed columns from the input table. So, for example, here if you see strong events is the input table for the query and from this table we are projecting event id state event type so that means these three columns will be included in the output of the table so whatever the output table comes out in the results that will contain only these three columns not only that you can rename the columns that means for example here we have a begin location column in the strom events table now we are kind of like a getting that column as a start location in the output that means it's not like actually renaming column on the input so this table column will not get re renamed this table will remain as is in the output whatever it generates in that output this column this begin location column will come as a start location not only that we can even compute some columns and get the output as a new column so for example here injuries direct and injuries indirect we are making a sum out of it and that sum we are getting it from this column called total injuries. So when I practically explain you this all this you will make more sense of it. Let me go to Kusto Explorer. So here in the Kusto Explorer under connection we have something called help cluster. If you know if you have seen my previous videos you already know how to connect to this help cluster and everything right. So please watch if you haven't seen the previous videos of this playlist and here there is something called samples database in the samples database under tables we have strom events folder in which we have strom events table so what i want to do from the strom events table i want to so let me take all the columns so just enter the table name and hit this run button to run that command and let's wait for the query execution to complete here great query executed successfully you can see we got 59000 plus rows and start time end time episode id event id state event type so all these are columns you can see injuries direct injuries indirect so we got all the columns from the table now i want to take only one second so there is some mistake here so i want to take only a few columns like event id state and event type so for that i will be using a pipe symbol then i am using an operator called project then whatever the columns I want, so I want event id, comma, and I want state, state column, then comma, I want event type columns. So now let me hit this run button to execute this query and let's wait for the query execution to complete here. We will be seeing only three columns, see event id, state and event type columns. So this is how we can project the columns from the input table to the output table whatever we are getting here so now let's assume i want to write a different uh, uh, statement here where i want to project there is something called begin location column in the table so this column i want to get as start location so what i can do here before that column type like this so start location equals to begin location that means from this column take all the rows keep in this column and show that results not only that what i want is i want to get the sum of injuries direct plus that means plus means sum injuries indirect so this is sum i want to compute and keep it in another column and that column name may be like a total injuries so if i do like this right this new column name and then put equals there then what it will do it will try to create a columns with these names and in the columns values will be after equals to whatever the expression we have here so now when i execute this query let me hit this run command to run it you will see we will get projection of two columns start location 
and total injuries and you can see here it will get the sum as well so this is how project operator will actually help you to project the columns and as i said it is equal to sql statement in sql server so if you already know sql server you know project as well just compare with the sql thing so that's it in this video i hope you understand how the select operator or sorry project operator will work in kushto query language thank you for watching Please subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to get the notifications whenever I add videos. Thank you so much.